Thank you all for coming. My name is Eric Solberg. I am your Pacific Northwest Castelli rep. And we're here to talk about Castelli shorts specifically today. We're gonna tie in how they tie in with some of the jerseys, but we'll get to the technologies of the shorts and the chamois. We'll start off with our Presto short. It is a great, great price point short that Castelli does. One of our better sellers. Comes in four color ways. The red and black one I have in my hand is one of our more popular ones. It uh, features an Infinity Lycra, which has a great hand to it. Very, very comfortable, soft to the skin. Uh, sewn in panels to the mimic the ergonomics of your body. Great gel gripper that's gonna stay, it's gonna stay uh, keep the short down on your thigh where it should be. And uh, same thing with the, the straps on the upper. As a high back, perforated material for breathability, that high back is going to keep the shoulder straps on your shoulders. They won't be sliding off all the time. One less thing to worry about as you're riding. Really, the, uh, the concept of most Castelli clothing is it's actually sewn to be on the bike and ridden. So as you look at the short, it actually mimics um, a, a riding position uh, as you, this is just hanging. So when it gets on your body, it doesn't work against you, it works with you. The chamois in the Presto short is our Kiss 3 pad. This is our third generation of the Kiss pad. We've been doing it for a number of years now. Probably one of our more popular pads. We only do two pads in the Castelli shorts. So even people are getting price point shorts are getting a really good quality, quality chamois that the racers are using in Europe and all over the world. The Kiss 3 pad, one thing about all Castelli pads is we don't use cookie cutter or garden variety chamois made by a couple of the large chamois manufacturers. We actually have a couple of very small suppliers we deal with directly in Italy that make an excellent product that is above and beyond what other people make. We use a technology called sculpting, which really allows the foam to stay in its natural state as opposed to compressing the foam like you get with most chamois. Um, most chamois, when you have this neat little pattern on it here. That is the chamois manufacturer taking a piece of foam and literally taking a compress and heat and pressing it and melting a lot of that foam down to get your thinner pieces. And you look at the Castelli chamois, you look at the bottom, you can see this is actually a, a two-piece or a three-piece chamois, if you will. Um, we have this white portion down here, which is the cover that is keeping the the working part of the chamois, the, the big thick pad part in place, and then you have the top portion, which is our cover layer, very soft to the skin, um, but very, very thin chamois. And that's the portion that we actually go through and we'll do that heat transfer or heat press, if you will, to get the perforations to allow the chamois to work. But the working part, we use a technology called sculpting, which takes the foam, which would be a higher density foam, leaving it in its natural state so we're not compressing it. So it's actually being able to work the way it's designed to work. And we will literally shave off or sculpt the, the padded or the portion part, the thicker part of the chamois. Very, very comfortable all around chamois. Made differently than about 90% of other chamois on the market where everyone else is using just about the same technology. Castelli's going outside the box and using something completely different benefits to the cyclist, more comfort, you can stay out and ride longer.